Good morning, boys and girls. Today I'm going to read you the story called Put Me in the Zoo by Robert Lopshire. This story is actually by Dr. Seuss, and the reason why it says Robert Lopshire is because he made up a silly fake name and he wrote some books using that silly fake name. But this story is really by Dr. Seuss. You know, Dr. Seuss is extra silly. He does all kinds of silly things like that, like make up fake names. I will go into the zoo. I want to see it. Yes, I do. Remember, we know Dr. Seuss. There's lots of rhymes in his story. I would like to live this way. This is where I want to stay. Will you keep me in the zoo? I want to stay in here with you. Hmm, that's interesting. Usually animals don't really want to be in cages or in the zoo. But this silly animal wants to be in the zoo. We do not want you in the zoo. Out you go. Out. Out with you. You see the guards are kicking him out. Why did they put me out this way? I should be in. I want to stay. Why should they put you in the zoo? What good are you? What can you do? What good am I? What can I do? Now here is one thing I can do. Look, now all his spots are blue. So the spots change colors. And now his spots are orange. Say, he looks very good that way. Now look at this. What do you see? Green spots, as green as green can be. Violet spots. Say, you are good. Do more, do more. We wish you would. I can do more. Look, this is new. Blue, orange, green, and violet too. Oh, they would put me in the zoo if they could see what I can do. I could put my spots up on this ball, and I could put them on a wall. Now he's putting his spots other places. I can put them on a cat, and I can put them on a cat. I can put them on the zoo, and I can put my spots on you. You see? They're on the kids now. Silly. Look at this now. One, two, three. I can put them on a tree. This book is great for you guys. You'd be able to read this yourself. Lots of sight words. And now when I say one, two, three, all my spots are back on me. Look now, here is one thing more. I take my spots, I make them four. Oh, they would put me in the zoo if they could see what I could do. I take my spots, I take them all, and I can make them very small. And now you see, I take them all and I can make them very tall. And when I want to have more fun, I take my spots and make them one. Yes, they would put me in the zoo, the things my spots and I can do. See, I could put them in a box. It says spot box. I take them out. They look like socks. Silly. I can, I can put them way up high. Up, up they go. I make them fly. Silly. I put them high up in the air. My spots fly here. My spots fly there. I call them back now. One, two, three. Now all my spots are back with me. Tell me, tell me now, you two. Do you like the things I do? Tell me, tell me now, you two. Will they put me in the zoo? We like all the things you do. We like your spots and we like you too. But you should not be in the zoo. No, you should not be in the zoo. Oh, he looks sad. I wonder why they're saying that. What do you think? With all the things that you can do, the circus is the place for you.
Yes, this is where I want to be. The circus is the place for me. The end. Hmm. So our character thought he wanted to be in the zoo, but he realized that the circus is probably a better place for him than all of his tricks. All right, so yesterday you read a book with Miss Hartman, and that was your 302nd book, 302. So we're going to add one more, and it's going to make it 303. That is our 303rd book. All right, I'll talk to you guys soon for another story later this week.